Moshi Moshi Miami Gamers and welcome back to Honkai Star Will. Sunday invites you to decide the victor of the Pentacle Grandeur stage. How we decide, since it's a major decision, it will be good to talk to your companions first. Today, we're going to discuss with our friends to see who is the winner. Listen, listen, my people. I'm gonna stand in the middle because why not? <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Um, let's talk with Himiko first. Does that mean he wants to fight us during the Charmony Festival? That's what I was expecting from last episode. I'm afraid so. This is weird. Aren't arc villains usually plotting some dirty conspiracy in the end? But he actually said something like, In all fairness, could it be that he's underestimating us? Well, in my opinion, Sunday is deeply committed to his own philosophy and genuinely wants to prove that the order is right. I sensed a strong conviction and a desire for dominance in him. Maybe he won't accept the outcome unless he wins fair and square. That's why he'll give it his all in the upcoming battle. Hmm. We won't back down either. Or level what? Yeah, you're right. We've even dealt with a Lord Ravager of the Destruction, so a follower of the Order won't be a big deal. Anyway, we can't leave the Stellaron unchecked. This is about trailblazing a bright future for Panacone, and fulfilling Mikhail's and his predecessors' long-cherished wishes. Now that we've taken up the mantle, we can't afford to fail them. However, the same applies to the Order. Their plan didn't materialize overnight, and they have the profound collective consciousness of the planet of festivities behind them. A desire to dream, to slumber and escape reality. All those hidden emotions have given birth to the sweet dream of the Order. They've harnessed the will of an entire planet to create an Eon. This confrontation is far more complicated than a simple power struggle. To secure Penacone's future, fighting on the stage alone is not enough. What do you mean? Are you not coming with us? I believe Firefly is trying to say that she's heading off to another battle. Mm-hmm. Aww. Understandable. Before I left, the Destiny Slave told me that this journey would bring unforgettable rewards. Even though the script he gave me only had a few lines, I couldn't ignore them. Because one of the lines said, I'll experience death. Three times in the land of the dreams. Three times? This can't be serious, right? The first time was a painful death when I was stabbed by the Blade of Dormancy, which led to all subsequent events. The script will always come true, but in a way that will only be revealed when that page is turned. So now I've understood the meaning of my second death. And I am prepared to face it. If all goes well, my efforts will provide crucial support for you. Only by achieving victory in this battle can we secure a future for Penacone. And only then, my third and final death won't come true in the most terrible form. The most terrible form? Does that mean... The true death. Where everyone in Panacone loses themselves completely in the eternal sweet dream of the Order. We must do everything we can to prevent that. Have you made up your mind, Firefly? Yes. Otherwise, I wouldn't be here. Thank you again for your assistance for the Astral Express. May we meet again, in reality. Yeah. Farewell, everyone. May your trailblazing expedition never end. Aw, oh, man! Firefly, my girlfriend is gone for now. Huh. <sighs> I dreamed of a scorched earth. Everyone, are you ready? Fire flashes <laughs> sprouted from the earth. What's she doing? It bloomed in the morning sun. 
Going up. Like fireflies to a flame. My feet are stiff. Ooh, chest boy. Again. Again. In reality. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> After today, Chapella's name will disappear from cosmic history. Oh, he saw this part of the, the past. The mansion will take its place. In the not too distant future. You'll receive an invitation. That's your next stop. Land of the dreams. Panacone. I hope you find whatever you seek there. Be it answers or salvation. <laughs> you mean my three deaths? Silverwolf told me about it. It's such a shame that it's not part of my script. Sorry. Well, I want <laughs> to live. I'm never afraid of death. The opposite of death is eternal life, and that's... That's something I'll never desire. People die. And I am no exception. Death is like a script. A fate that cannot be defied. That's exactly why we have to choose when we want to rest forever. Do you exist just to perish? Are you not the same, Blade? The end you desire is not one dictated by others. If I were to die now, I would only be a weapon. I believe... I should die as a human, though its definition escapes me. Isn't this the answer that ordinary people look for their whole lives? A name that can be carved onto their tombstone. The tombstone that belongs to me once bore the inscription, Glamoth's Iron Cavalry. Then it changed to Stellaron Hunter. But one day, it will be bear the name Firefly and all the brilliance she showed at the end of her life. In the meantime, so are the dreams bit. quite unexpected, old man. Who would have thought your crazy plan would actually work? Do all you nameless fools just act on a whim? I can sense that this false sweet dream is coming to an end. The Nameless may be young, but they had the ability to achieve this goal. Just like you did in your time. It's a shame you won't be able to see it firsthand. <laughs> Maybe I won't either. Once something fictional is seen through, it ceases to exist. Yeah, not just those Nameless. Even Mr. Wings is just like you. Stubborn, won't listen or give up. No matter what. Well, fate is unpredictable, I guess. If we weren't bound by those cursed paths, maybe we could have had some good talks. But in the end, we managed to do it. And now we can find solace. Remember how those idiots cursed us? Is it go to hell, you worthless traitors? <laughs> well, I don't know if they really meant it, but if longing for freedom means going to hell, then I'll be joining you soon, you fool. Hmm. Let's get together and have supper again in hell. Nice. Oh, I almost forgot. There's one more thing. Here's to you. A glass of hello and goodbye, trailblazer, to the imperfect tomorrow. Tomorrow. More there, isn't it? <gasps> More pastels, okay. You're lucky to have found shelter from the rain. Let alone fresh berries in this desolate place. <laughs> I was just following the scent of life. It's particularly strong in a place like this. It's a shame these berries don't have much flavor. Seriously? 
In case you didn't know, this fruit is pretty juicy. The only downside is that when you chew it, it becomes extremely spicy. <clears throat> Have you lost your sense of taste? <clears throat> I can still taste certain things, like a faint sweetness. Before coming here, I stopped by a place called Orkron. It had barren cliffs and nights lit by bonfires. Burgundy snow would fall from the sky, and when it landed on my tongue, it tasted like raspberries. The flavor wasn't exactly sweet, but it left a lasting impression. When I think back on my past, I realize that what's tying everything together isn't the big events, but rather these small yet unforgettable moments. Don't worry about it. Losing oneself is a reality that every self-annihilator must face. At least, I haven't completely lost my senses and memories yet. Well, congratulations on adding another footnote to your journey. By the way, are you always alone? No, I had a companion in Orkron. She's a short, nameless girl who aspired to explore IX. She always said she'd walk another planet deeper and farther than Akavilis. How many plans is there? It's quite an ambition for such a small girl. So uh, what happened? She became stagnant water. Well, my condolences. Condolences? I don't need them. The girl left with a smile. She never regretted her choice and most definitely wanted me to say goodbye with a smile. So, that's what I did. That's proof that you're grieving for her. Or perhaps I'm just afraid. Afraid? I rarely sense that emotion from you. What do you fear? I'm afraid I'll forget the 30 days I spent with her. Just like all the other days in my life. Most of them have already washed away with the rain, disappearing into an unseen realm. I fear that those vivid red memories will fade away too. There isn't much color left. And besides this faint, warm red, there's almost nothing. Hard to imagine. A ranger accustomed to bloodshed, destruction, and chaos finding warmth in the red color. Because I have experienced this warmth many times. Long ago, I promised someone that I'd bring it to more people. And that for every remaining moment of my life, I'd strive for a better ending for all. As long as this red color still lingers, I have a chance to fulfill that promise. It represents a burning fire, a blooming flower, the berries in this cave, and life itself. Fleeting, yet still dazzling. In the end, it will lead me beyond the horizon of existence. And on the other side, I will cut off Nihility. <laughs> the one blessed by the sleeping and shapeless is considering how to kill them. That's truly pure Nihility. But you're right about one thing. After spending so much time near this stagnant water, only when I look at this vibrant red fire do I realize that I'm still alive. When will this rain ever stop? Perhaps when the sorrows of the departed have finally quieted down the sky will clear up. Hmm. Follows us out to the Sesame Festival. Have you heard of a planet named Biari Scamandros, Don Hung? More plannings? It's one of the Paradise Kingdoms under the influence of the Harmony. A sought after wonderland for the inhabitants of the Dardanu Major and Minor system. Half an amber era ago, the family held an unprecedented festival there. And after that, 
everyone on the planet became part of the family. Do you think the same thing will happen on Penacony? Yes. Or how else can we explain it? The family deliberately used the Watchmaker's invitation to keep all the Pathstriders here, but banished the Emanator of the Nihility. Because of the Nihility, I'm rarely affected by the power of other Paths, but somehow I can unconsciously infiltrate them. <laughs> Maybe that's the risk they're trying to avoid. I would disagree. Biori Scamandros is not part of the credit system or connected to the Silver Rail. It's nothing more than a remote civilization sheltered by the Harmony. But Panacone is... different. If the family messes with Panacone, that would be like declaring war on almost half of the factions in the cosmos. They have no reason to do that. No, they don't. If they truly serve the Harmony, that is. What do you mean? The path in Panacone is impure. The harmony here has impurities. Do you remember the ancient swarm disaster? Tazeront, the propagation, brought endless havoc to the universe. And it eventually evolved into a fierce battle among all eons. Two paths lost their eons in that war. The propagation and the order. Coincidentally, their downfall is related to a certain eon. Shipe, the Harmony. Legend has it that they participated in the crusade against the Imperator Insectorum and devoured Anna the Order for unknown reasons. Holy Forgaroni! So you're saying that the two leaderless paths are working behind the scenes? But I don't see any descendants of the propagation in Penacony. Could it be that the remnants of Beyond the Sky Choir are hiding within the family, trying to resurrect a fallen Eon? I can't say for sure, but they're definitely planning something for the Charmony Festival. This is getting way too complicated. Is this why you want us to leave Astana right away? Are you giving up? The Charmony Festival will start soon. There's one thing that I need to confirm no matter what. A warp jump is the best way to do so. Mm. Time is running out. I have another plan. What's your plan, Dayhan? Hold on. Are you thinking of using the Jade Abacus of Allying Oath? Exactly. The assistance from the Lofu Cloud Knights would be enough. <gasps> Think it over carefully. You can only hey. use that once in your lifetime. I have considered it thoroughly. My companions are... They're also once-in-a-lifetime treasures. All right. So who are you bringing, Jing Yuan? Three system hours until the sewing festival. Are you the only one here, my child? The Nameless is quite the diplomat. Our secrets have spread like wildfire within the family. And IPC starships are gathering towards Astana. This is a crucial moment for us. So, where is the Chosen One who harmonizes the varied sounds? Why the sister? <laughs> what do you mean, Master? I'm right here in front of you, aren't I? You know, she was supposed to be the star of the Charmony Festival. In our plan. But the plan has changed. As her brother, I... I know she doesn't want to sing for the Order. So I'll take her place. Hmm. You've always been wise beyond your years. I'm sure you understand the consequences of your choice. If you consider this a betrayal, well, there can't be two suns in the sky. I'll step up and take down the other sun if necessary. Do you believe in karma? That's a real thing. <laughs> if karma exists, Don't say then if everyone has karma. their own karma. You have yours, and I have mine. And my karma has nothing to do with you, Mr. Gopherwood. Hmm. All right. 
Since you're willing to sacrifice yourself for her, I'll grant your wish. Well, the compromise came sooner than expected. Why? You and your sister were born as twins of the Order. And one of you is destined to follow this path to the end. Is this part of your plan? Of course. You're still as clever as you were when you were a child. The opening is near. Go, my child. Seize the power of the harmony and reveal your karma. I have one final question, Master. Why did you choose to bring the Order to Penacony? Wouldn't it have been better to choose a desperate world instead of a city filled with hope and dreams? Why? It's for justice, my child. Justice? If we lose justice in our hearts, we'll make the same mistake as the harmony did. So, it's not you who manipulates the dreamscape with the Stellaron, but... Well, that's where our conversation ends. Go ahead. The 107,336 souls of the Oak family have dreamed of this moment too many times. It just fed down, what the hell? I'll just... I'll stomp it or kick her, like fuck this thing! I shall ascend to the heavens, becoming the scorching sun bathed in my light. What the hell? My people what are some miracles? While all evil shall be eradicated. What the fuck is going on to House of Outsell Summer this Festival? This is the interior of the Penacony Grand Theater. Oh, it's quite my exhilarating to be flushed into the air by Soul Glad. But oh well, Why she'll come. She'll come. Still close when the Charmony Festival is about to start. I believe she'll be back with us later. And not only that, in the, the game. entire theater is eerily quiet. No audience. No staff. No one around. Interesting. Looks like the Charmony Festival is a flop at the box office. Yeah. I wonder how many tickets. Hey, that's not what we should be concerned about. Let's explore around. Be careful, everyone. Yeah, be careful, everyone. Hey, we got a hat. <gasps> a chest behind us? Why would it be there? Hold on, let me actually... You're not looking at us, so I'm gonna grab this. You're not looking at Robin, so you keep posing like that. Why don't I just go walk away from you? Oh, wow. Investigating this quiet location. You guys see that? It seems kinda... Ooh, this area looks block. Okay. If that's block and that is block... Put that down. Like, brother! Brother! Oh, I only... The atmosphere here is so creepy and unsettling. Okay, there's no audience yet. There should be some staff around. Why is it so silent? Oh, you're not one, though. Oh, this should open! That's like an open space to open for the map area. Anyways, Oni-chan! Oni-chan! What are you? Oni-chan? Oh, what? Are those staffs? Huh? Th those dolls don't look more like mannequins. Huh? Pretty terrifying ones. Would there be, would there be buds here around I'm curious about? Don't want the tiptoes. Mm, I mean, they're ballerinas, that's what it is. Oh, there is a bud. Yank, get off! I know this song now because how the voice like. There you go, another one. There you go. Chap, did you put a gong taller? The play I plant a bird in the ground and the bird is good to really tall, Chub. If I keep watching myself and when I go so tall that I can't even fit into the teeth of Chub, that's kind of creepy as hell. What's well to feel? I bet I can go even taller than the great tree Chub. If all our birds could go. Oh, so tall. Even Boss Stone would have to hide from us, Chub. What a good idea. I'll go let Lady Vermin know the plant into a soil, Chub. But why? Okay, let me grab this. 
Hmm. So quiet. So. <gasps> Ooh, we got this. What's this? Collect a night bird's wings. Now let's look around here. What's going on? There seems to be something I gotta go around here for the. Uh, maybe over here? Such in the grand deed. I'm looking. Okay, found it. <sighs> Yikes! They scared the life out of me! Uh, why are there so many puppets at the ticket office? Hmm. Much behind you? What? Ugh, you're so annoying. Stop scaring me. We're trying to be funny. Jeez. Are these puppets part of the stage setup? Maybe. Even so, it's so eerie that the entire front hall is empty. Hey, like, like, what's, like, what the fuck's going on? Like, hello? Oh my god. <laughs> Only Chan. Why do you have these creepy ass shit? Our master is scaring the shit out of us. Something feels. Ah, we're in the right place, right? There's no other grand theater in the dreamscape. So Sunday's messing with us? He said we'd have a final showdown on the stage, but why is there no one here? My apologies for the delay, March 7th. <laughs> you scared me! Where are you now? I'm waiting for you behind the curtain. Following the Asdana tradition, I invite you to enjoy a stage play in three acts before the festival begins. History is a mirror reflecting the universe's true essence. Let's use this opportunity to delve into the rich history of Penacony and the eons. Within it, naturally, the future takes shape. Right. Let us commence with the dawning of the world. Dawning After of the, the world. After the dusk wars. Darkness veiled the sky, and chaos consumed the earth. Hey, little opens. Anna, the order emerged, destined to restore all existence. Oh, that's what Sunday is. A disc that marked the first Ooh, day. Interesting. Oh, another one. And then we got this one. Ooh, wait, what? Is that two or just one? Different ones. That's kind of. That's what Sunday is. Whoa! Hold up, did I saw a chest or something? They gathered nebulae and forged them into picks, thus creating a grand lyre do. with black and white Actually, I'll get them keys. like in a, in a different time. Strike the white keys. You keep talking. The sun rose. Strike the black keys, and the moon rose. So the chest heal. I'll get that one. And so, the cycle of day and Holy night Chad! Rose. Can you stop that, please? That get that out there! The second. Okay, let's keep walking. Oh, busy audience! Why has it be like. I don't know. Oh, while they're playing at, that's kind of. Oh, we're actually going the puppets here. are gathering around the frame. Are they expecting us to enter it? Stop playing down. Let's go in. Touch it, Robin. Like. Ah! Stage play act one. Oldie to prisoner. Oh, let's translate that. I'll be like, what the hell, hell is that saying? Okay, play. Where are we now? The atmosphere here looks similar to Sunday's inner world. Perhaps this so-called stage play is created with his abilities. This act is named Ode to Prisoner. Mm -hmm. Given the atmosphere here, I believe it's about Penacony's past. I thought things were finally looking up as I managed to dodge prison during my recent trailblazing expeditions. But now it looks like I'll be back behind bars again. With us is what it is. I but genuinely wish to avoid a violent clash with my esteemed guests from afar. Therefore, I've arranged three acts before the situation becomes irreparable. Mm -hmm. Where shall we start? Do we well, the well, let's start with like. the time when Penacony was still a frontier prison. New enemies. I'm gonna grab the chest. I mean, if they see me, I'll fight back if I have to. You're an idiot. You're not looking at the direction I'm supposed to go to. Oh, hold up. That's still two. Should I deal with that first? Okay, you will quickly discover some scattered dream bubble in the map. Due to them being uncut to the puzzle puffing, these dream bubbles can 
form bubble bridges. After interacting with the control panel, the resident dream model of the movie will be highlighted. By interacting with the control panel, the dream model can be moved along the design strategy. When moving the dream model, the scattered dream bubbles on the surface will also move with it. When the pump the placement of the shadow dream bubble meet the requirement of forming a bubble bridge, these dream bubbles will congeal. When this happens, approach with the bubble charge to manifest a bubble bridge. Okay, got it. You're standing here. Are you evil? I don't want to hit that. Don't mind that. Let me just touch this. Move the models. You're doing just good, Robin. Like hell yeah, I'm doing a good job. Upside down too. Ooh, there's a few of them here. It's upside down. Okay. In 2147 A.E., a talking? prisoner named Hanun ignited a struggle for liberty and emerged triumphant. IPC referred to it as the War of the Frontier, while the Asdanians dubbed it the War of Independence. Yeah, we're going. Hold up, so <gasps> there's a chest up here. Okay, okay, I'm looking around just in case. Before we move on, let me touch that. Go, Robin. Touch that. Okay, is that for extra carnage? Now this has to move to the other side. Wait, what? When the surface of the dream world has been away from a bubble bridge, moving the side will destroy the form of button. The bubble tries to turn the building. Okay, yeah, that's obvious. Move. I don't think that's been explained actually. I already knew about that. So, let me go. Oh, I have one. Okay, never mind. Robin's doing a good job. He's like, the fuck is this, Oni Chan? It's true that Hanunu was a legendary hero, but it must be acknowledged that while he bestowed freedom upon the prisoners, he didn't grant them true liberation. Thank you for staying here, honorable travelers. The three However, nameless um, stay on the planet, the endeavoring to spread the, the tenets of truth grace throughout the die, 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 die. prison. Alas, their efforts proved futile. I don't want to fight them. Okay, um, 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 okay, let me just, let me just go down here. There's a chest over here. Oh, okay. <sighs> okay. Now let's just take that down and then just head back. Push. Wait, hold up. Can I get down there? Oh yeah, good, 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 good. good. Once again. As Donna was engulfed in war, this time the enemies originating from within. The prisoners remained prisoners for the rest of their lives, okay. fighting for freedom rather than living for it. Ooh. Ooh, extra chest. Okay, Act 1 completed? Are we find that? I hope you like this land of freedom. On a scorched earth. Was that a new enemy? As you can see, their sentences have long ended, and the IPC guards have long been expelled. Yet, these prisoners remain enslaved, not by external forces, but by the confines of their own minds. Freedom permeates every corner, except fragile souls. It gives solace only to those who believe in its existence. Prisoners, this is my order. Learn the essence of freedom and teach your fellow prisoners to fight for their lives. That's a woman? That's boobs. Hey, why do we have to fight while enjoying the show? That doesn't seem at all. For I desire not only your enjoyment, but also your assistance in its completion. Is that really a dude? Ouch! Tonight. You go sing, Robin. Tonight, the stars echo because of me. Perform in front of your brother, Sunday. Really? I'm gonna shoot right away. As soon as I get attacked. 
双龙。Preparing for collection. Um. What is it now? You still don't Burn. You already know that conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Oh. Damn. What are you doing? You still hitting him? Poison play, is that what it's called? You got a cool slant child! My turn. Sure, go ahead! Okay, let's take this one first. One at a time. Commence and research. then hit this one Coming and freeze. Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. <laughs> time to freeze! Hey, nah, I'm not frozen. Go ahead, Mikko. Ah, oh, song's over. So this is what Jenny with in the meantime? I got shield. You can't do shit. You can't run. You have the worst luck running into me. Okay, this is. Yeah. Okay. You get shield. You get shield. Now, bud. Here yourself. Here yourself, Robin. You go give the crit rate attack. Well, I mean, crit damage. But the bonus damage. That's what it is. But, oh. My turn. Stay right there while I give you a present. There you go. Let's do ah, this. Ah. Nice. This is a while. Bring us victory. The harmony will soon play in unison. Damage attack. <laughs> ah, it's been disturbed. Uh, Even attack. Play. Why? That seems unfair if you chose both. Uh, I think something bit me. You have the worst luck running into me. Now let's give. Uh, oh, you need one With too. Me out here, Back to my. Now swing. Oh, you about to lose that defense. Go for an end to strife in the now I got an idea. Let's sing our hearts out. The stars echo because of me. Alright, so every act we're gonna fight enemies for the boss fight. Me, Three in one. Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. Please. Perhaps you still now you're bun. You already know that conceals its desire to control the heavens. And I'm no exception. So much damage being done here. If that bitch is frozen. Burn. Damn. Try that again. That's what you do. You can't run. My turn. Who's the shield? What you do? Right there while I give you a present. Combat is a series of precise. No, say some Target's healing. Preparing for collection. Himiko, you need one. Oh, even my much. Okay. Should have been much. Quiet down. I have to quiet down. Try that again. Ooh. Okay. Now she needs to be shielded up. Me. You need to be shielded up With now. Me out here? How can we lose? Time for okay. you take one then you attack. And then you do light. Thanks a lot. Extra quit damage. Four and three. To travel far away. <laughs> Heal us. Like yours, we're gonna try them all. Hmm? 
Here's the drug! Try hard much better. Now you freeze them up. What does that mean? Oh, I see why. The ones that attack dogging attack. I see why. Okay. At least your HP's alright. Okay. I wouldn't say that while I've been when you say that. Quit damage! Oh, my angel is gonna be jealous! So tonight, the stars echo because of me! Rise up into my... Yeah, beat the ass. My turn. Um, right you know what, sure, here's a shield. Oh, but now let's One take it time. down. Not the child! Really? Running into me with me out here, how can we lose? Now let's do this. No, let me swing and then freeze and burn. Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. Perhaps you still don't now burn. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. He's almost dead. Yeah, he's almost dead. Are you a dude or you're a woman? He's clearly almost dead. How much HP do you have left? Like, boy. Come on, are you gonna be dead by now if I do one more strike, right? Now it's destroyed. Let's go wild. You anymore. You are free. Thus concludes the first act. I swear, we'll find enemies war, every act. I is gonna be a long recording. Headed toward becoming land of the exiles. This must be how. I mean, if I had to fight the boss next episode, I'll do it. With the aid of outsiders, the prisoners were finally liberated and established the land of the exiles. However. It appears that Sunday aims to convey the spiritual plight of the prisoners more than the physical aspects of imprisonment. Uh, this show is a bit too... literary for my taste. But the battle part is quite easy to understand. Anyway, we've arrived at the exit. Let's go! Let's <sighs> act one over. Bow to Wobbin! Where are they guiding us this time? Bow to Wobble, you pets! Puppets, I mean! Yeah, bow, my beautiful thing! My outfit, my heels, and me attacking! Okay, let's get out of here. Alright. Out there, open up. They hmm. transmuted streams of stars into inked nibs, creating symbols Can to be just... pronounced and counted. They molded stardust into flowing rivers, assigning the righteous upstream and the unjust downstream. Ooh, there's chess here. Thus, all things were marked, and the world learned to discern oh, you fall. What am I doing? and evil. That marked the third and fourth days. Oh yes, I knew that. So I gotta go to here. Hold up a sec. Is there any chest around here before I move on? Oh, yes, there's. Hey, the bud! He's like, hey, hey, what's up? Now, let me get this. And then, Lady Vuma is the name of the bird that the one of the birds said. Let me make these two. No more relaxing. I need extra credits. Now, act two as what he said. Wait, what's this? Let me read this real quick. The cover code of the Planet Physics series are designed and released by Dream Master and Esmus of the At the Very Pleasure House. All I reserves are otherwise, rules will be prosecuted. Wings shielded the forest from the tourist train, while a shadow veil of the scorching sun over the wasteland. Only those who soar alongside him 
knew it was an owl gliding through the twilight, poised to guide the knave away from the start of ignorance. He bought precious gems of wisdom to give to the ignorant children, decorating the new with nests to shield them from the cold. Unfurling the wings of knowledge, he plucked dirt perfect laughter and 70% respiratory from the night sky, making the earth glow with the wizards of starlight. As the sun emerged, he had already vanished from the heavens. Twelve cities stood on the earth, for those were the jing he left behind for the foolish bird. Another frame! I wish I grabbed, right? Let me break that down. Robin, go this way. There you go. Now, Act 2. And then Act 3. Act 2. Oldie to Fool. I'm dealing with these first, and then if I have to, guys, uh, an episode after Act 3, make Ode it the final fool. part. This must be the second act. The surroundings are different from before. The stage decorations. Look a bit tidier now? A little creepy too. Look at the background. Ooh. Behold the ensuing tale. A struggle for power. Panacone witnessed the ascent of the seven major lineages. Tree, grass, flower, bird, beast, fruit, and insect. Done talking? Peace never truly graced land of the exiles. The history in this era is rich and intricate, so please allow me to present it in allegorical form. Okay. You. Okay. Let me. You got your ears from there? Oh, God, how a stranger. Can you please play the piano? Chup, chup. The piano won't make a sound no matter how much I bang on the chip. Uh, skill issue. Did I already say that? It put a close on sort of to play a piano after all. I'll use my wings next time, Chup. Lady from this said the bodies will complain the instrument is much more popular, but I can't seem to be able to pick it up, Chup. No, I can't give up. I must find an instrument that even a body can play, Chup. Yeah, see you later. Extra money, extra wise. Now we must. Oh wow, enemies here. Um, hold up. I'm suspecting there are chests around here. Like, if I go down this way, there's a chest over there and do too. I mean, I could get a chest if I wanted to, but I'm gonna do it like an like off camera, it'd be easier. Now, we got a chest piece to deal with. Now, this looks like it belongs to right here. That's pretty easy. Even this one. Now, the red pieces, it probably belongs to. Um, probably this one. Never mind, not this one. One one. This one goes right here, and this goes right here, and this goes right here. And is that just on there? Ooh, ooh, yes it is. And... the are enemies swimming around here, why would we place that? Land of the Exiles was in disarray, besieged by both internal and external perils. Though the seven major lineages appeared united on the surface, each harbored their own ambitions, leading to ceaseless conflict. You keep talking, I'm doing this. Okay, I gotta turn this. Yep. Even this. This and this. That's pretty relaxing. I gotta go down there. Accountant, we are the pillars of this mansion. The Black Plum family was the first to fall. They withered away in the White Desert event. Orchestrated by the Alfalfa family. Because Master shaped you from clay, but forged me from fire. I'm superior to you. Superior, huh? What are you gonna My say? Child, you did not serve the, the leader of the Alfalfa family sought to defect to the IPC, trading freedom for survival. However, his eldest Still, Jesse, son I saw slew I was him looking? in the oh, name yeah. of righteousness. Don't have to deal with you guys. Uh -huh. Ascended as the new family head. All right, let me bound the treasure. All right, now this is like an exit. Looks like it looks like an exit. Um, this one, and then this one, and then turn it around. An exit. Y'all see it? 
Oh, yes, there is. Ugh, now I'll go that way. Oh, Lloyd. Yeah? Only when Gopher Wood led the family to and land liberate. of the exiles and earned recognition from all five major lineages did Panacone earn its new name, the Land of the Dreams. Oh, expected, expected. Enemies to fight again. What the hell is that thing? Oh, so not different ones. Okay, that's interesting. He looks... Oh, wow. He looks very unique. You want us to help you? What do you need? I wish they could regain their reason and cast away the shackles of hypocrisy. This is the second act. Looks like it's about Penacone's journey to becoming the land of the dreams, during which the family plays a crucial role. But this new master seems like a bad guy to me, don't you think? He Perhaps does. This is the truth Sunday is trying to express. If you read between the lines, the harmony changed Penacone just as the guards once did. Looks like we've got to help those guys kneeling down over there calm down a bit, right? Yep. Ooh, can I just fight this thing? I mean, if I don't have to, then yeah, thank you for not letting me lay a hand on you. Like, let's calm down by singing. You got the nice call, my boy. I would love you to sing with me. Okay, let's do artists. <laughs> In the absence of my master, I am free. <sighs> but without their guidance, for whom shall I sing? Hmm, the key human hearts finds that we built out the own with the covenants, proclaiming the new master. Activate clockwork. Happiness? Okay, they're all gonna come down. Sing for my new master, just as their noble voice once resonated throughout the cosmos. Oh, yeah, I got that ability too. Hey, wait, am I getting. Wait, are they all gonna... <gasps> oh, I see now. How about you next? Master, oh, you will return in due course. And I shall stand vigilant, awaiting the reward for my loyalty. Only reasons you can see the people from the prison into the past. But can the new master? Activate the clock, Wookie. You look pissed. Hey, calm the fuck down. Damn. Oh, where's the chest? No I guess there's only one. I shall seize what is rightfully mine. Okay. Next. Once I stood as the most loyal guard among all the servants. Now, with my master banished, it's my right to assume control of his dominion. In the absence of the covenants, there's no, there's exists no path to libertation from the clutches of death, proclaiming the new master. Okay. You, stop crying like a bitch. The angry, no, 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 no. This puppet isn't responding at all. Okay, I didn't mean that. One, I could have wanted to click it like twice, I guess I did not. Come. There you go. My former master has long departed. But why do I still fear the remnants of his creation? Hmm, why? To my left. Master is no longer here. I thought I'd be free, but I'm not. Now, without my master's command, I'll have to seek guidance from the blind. Only the calm one can evade the influence of the hidden investigator. Proclaim the new master. Alright, you need to be calm. There master you go. Master is no longer here. I must seek a new master, and serve them faithfully. Yeah, yeah, sure. Either I shall be my own master, oh, by the way, you or I shall return to Riddle. my former master. I shall not submit to a new master under any circumstances. I wish I could regain the reason and cast aside to help to proclaim the new master. He didn't seem happy at all, that's my guess. Okay, here you go. Without a master. Who can grant me true freedom? Alright. Thank you, dear outsiders. My servants have regained their sanity. Heed me, one and all. Your former master shall not return. It is through righteousness and unwavering support for one another that we shall attain 
true perfection. Cast aside the veils of hypocrisy and embrace one another. Get ready. Looks like another fight is about to begin. Is this like what they called infamous theta? I knew it! Could this kick his ass in the first place? Alright, let's go. What are you doing? Huh? That's like wine! Oh, we're being targeted. Uh oh, March is what we gotta use a shield ability. You just fist my girl like that? Ooh, ouch. Detailed overhaul. Ooh, I would double it down if I wanted to, like Shoy. Someone, come on. Ooh, ouch. Okay, um, let's try. They're both weak, those two, so I'm gonna try that one. Okay, okay, let's divide. What you doing now? Okay, this what Why are you pulling down him? I mean her. Okay, healing needs to get started as soon as possible. That was a bad move, Vale. Uh, gotta stop the bleeding. Okay, uh, ooh, no, you better go down. Middle. Your defense is down. Love that ability. Let's go. Ouch. Hit yourself. Electrifying. And shocking us. I think something bit me. Mm-hmm. My turn. Uh, With me out here, combat. how can we lose? I hope for an end. Oh, well, middle again. What are you doing? Oh. And we all got hurt. Oh. What a boy, a boy, just like taking a shower. You're funny. One at a time. Commencing research. Okay. Actually, no, let's do a whole billion now. Heal. <laughs> Like yours, we're gonna try all. Heal. Ah, thanks a lot. It's like, you're welcome, guys. Excuse me, coming through. Since is weak now, I'm just gonna. Ooh, who needs to shoot more? You do, Robin. Right there, while I give you a present. Oh. Attacking him, Michael, just like that. Uh oh, defense back up. It's about to close line us. Try that again. It's like, motherfucker, come here. Ooh, it's about to break down. How about I sing? And if you're also ready. Oh, no, it's not. Not yet. It's okay. It's okay. Ooh, you're in a tough spot here, Miko. They're both in. Okay, let's go. I broke you. Aha! You can't attack now since I broke that. Hey, that was gone. But the burn away. Not the senior. You can't run. Goodbye. I told you I could fight. All right. Uh, With let's me out here, room. how can we lose? Can't kill anyone, but that's okay. Sing. The stars echo because of me. Rise up. Combat is a series. Attack plus that. You also attack, and you also attack. Now use the alt. Still got your bun! Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens. And I'm no exception. Your point? Okay. Um. Stay right there while I give you a present! 
is because I'm saving the E abilities for more. Strike. Half HP. She's getting wet while singing. Uh oh. Ouch. Oh shit. Uh oh. Human Cody's a more now. Okay, here we go, these are more. Oh lord, here we go. Heal, heal, heal. Okay, um, no, let's still heal everyone. Like, take the drug! Take the drug. Okay. You have the worst right there while I give you a present. You need a shield. Here you go. Combat is okay. a series of precise mechanics. Swing at that one. May song for no, the attack. Quiet down. With the buds. Target specimen. HP. Here you go. Super. I'm getting more My wet! Turn. God damn it! With me out here, how can we lose? Now let's sing out you. Ah. It's better be patient than just rushing it down with your ear abilities. That's some people do. Ooh, I was getting targeted. You're fine. Oh, good. Oh, boy, much. Damn. You have the worst luck running into okay, me. Okay, Robin, you need it. Stay right there while I give you a present. Time for detailed one at a time. You but lose composure. Here we go. Quiet down. You won't get away. Ah, they've been disabled. Now what? Perfect. And swing. I'm making her wet too. My turn. Shield ability. Um. Three. With me okay, out much, here, much. how can we lose? Combat Give me go. Precise. Huh? Huh? E. That's okay. Huh? The power of music. The harmony will soon play in unison. Okay, you go sing. Soul shall embrace. Tonight, the stars echo because of me. What's actually saying so far? Coming through. That's a good damage. Attack with that. Oh, we burn him. Now three and four. Alright, oh, let's go. You still don't understand. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens. And I'm no exception. Still standing! Oh lord. Someone's going to shoot it? Uh, let's get to the child. To go down with the power of music. Well, he was I'm about to go down. Oh, God With me out here, go down. No, here we go. Let's do it. <laughs> For a tough case like yours, we're gonna try them all! 
How many times you dropped us, kid? About probably six times. Much better. Oh, Diamond Flames. Goodbye. <laughs> we got you. Alas, they remain but slaves till the very end, with the illusion of freedom. Thus concludes the second act. Amidst an illusory harmony, Land of the Exiles charted its course toward becoming the planet of festivities. This is how Penacony fell under the family's control. Mm -hmm. Since the arrival of the Harmony, the Land of the Exiles has undergone dramatic changes. Not all of which have proven... beneficial. This guy really loves dramatic scenes. Bet he comes from a whole lineage of stage performers. Yep, now let's get out of here. Like, oh boy, hold up, hold up, hold up. Something is behind that, buddy. Chup, I don't want to go the theater. Everyone that passes by has the answer my will, Chup. The special room is filled with mirrors. Guess how many they are, Chup? You get the prize for the correct answer. I'll eat you up if you get a one, Chup. Uh, you think you can stomach me? Fuck, fuck, fuck! Don't underestimate it in a water bottle. A power type chub. Ho, ho! Look like you got it right. There's this, I don't know how many they are, chub. Smart human, get away from my water, chub, chub. The bird pops your forehead gently. The flies away the shish Huh? Wild. Oh, that's a word. Okay. Now. Open the pussy. Now, where am I? Uh, now I'm gonna go down there. They used the planetary rings to establish the law. Forging a code of conduct among the masses. A grand lyre with black and white keys served as an instrument, while symbols of articulation and numerical notation took the form of musical notes. The downward flowing river became a melody, and the canon of law dictated the form. Thus, all mortals found their unique place within this symphony. That marked the fifth and sixth days. Okay. Oh, I after this one, I am done. Guys really into these puppets. I mean, yeah, kind of creepy. Enter inside the dreamscape world. Stage play act three. Ordeal. Old D2 order. Which is the last one I'm gonna deal with and I'm done. Oh, I get it now. The last scene is all about singing the praises of the order. And the atmosphere here is completely different from the previous two scenes. Yeah, pretty much. This is the concluding act of this play. Can I, I have showcased the past and present of Penacony, hoping that my de Okay, sorry about that, Sunday. Chub, you have been done found by the genius designed? Look at the Ingrid Stone. The is the Ingrid Sculpture. Ah, I'm in love with this place, Chub. You design it? What a build must be some understanding, Chub. I deal with no good if I were the one who built this place, Chub. My work are much more designed than it, and my knowledge was shower, Chub. Goodbye, Chub. I have my own, my own craft, friend. One day I'll make something to chop this masterpiece, Chub. Yeah, this bye. is the concluding act of this play. I have showcased the past and present of Penacony, hoping that my desire for change resonates within you. And now, I shall reveal its future to you. If the people lack okay. we will make choices on their behalf and their Hold up. Any, 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 um, chest surrounded there too while I'm doing this? Probably not. Without a king, who shall protect you? And we shall support you. And standing against the might. Oh, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Hmm, what was the talking? I'm sorry about that. You just keep walking this way. You keep looking that way. Amaya, uh, uh, what happened? Alright, so my guess is we do this puzzle piece to go to the other side of the bridge, that's what it looks like. Or maybe just a chest only. Okay, um, it's upwards, isn't it? Not? Um, it's probably this one, nope, not this one. No, not this one. Okay... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, this is a little confusing, you go back in here. 
There we go, I got it right this time. Let me scroll down. That belongs to the top piece that I was trying to do. There you go. Um, that's what piece is. Hold on a minute. Okay, there you go. Uh, that's what piece is. Which is this one right here. And then... You get placed right here. And then this gets placed right here. And then... Right here. And then right here. And then right here. Okay, I take it back. I thought this chest would... I mean, I this puzzle just lead to like an open area, but I guess not. Alright, they push down. Back away. Um... So I'm supposed to go that way, apparently. Is that baiting? No, this is, that seems very unlikely, actually, if you ask me. What's... Oh, I need another one, though. No. Okay, okay, let me grab uh, another piece. You just keep staring at that. Wait, did I just cave him there? I believe I did, actually. You're not going that way. Okay. And what's next? I'm finding another enemy for this. That's the annoying part. I have to deal with that. Everything followed its and natural course, and so it shall continue even after the king's departure. Which? Nice. After the king's departure, we no longer have room for a king, for we have become kings of all things. Hold on, damn minute. How am I supposed to get a chest over there? Nah, never mind that. I need to focus on the story quest for no. <gasps> oh, we're here already! Oh, that one's red. Ooh, what is that? Hey, aren't we supposed to kick off a short story and have a fight here just like we did in the previous acts? Why aren't any of these puppets saying anything? Perhaps we'll need to complete the story ourselves. Just like we did before. So, do you think their mind needs tinkering or something? Hmm. Maybe. What do you look like? Oh, wow. A, a thing with tits! And they even pass around them. How does Sunday do that? Alright, General. Based on the experience from Act 2, it seems you need to follow the clock up once again to possibly bring the promise to, to Futurons. Satis what the hell is that? Farmer King. What? How did it go? I can't change the emotions. You can't change them? What does that mean? My apologies for my negligence. I forgot to inform you that the final part was scripted long ago. Let our previous king recount it to you. Now it is time for the final fight. Prepare for battle. Looks like we'll have to fight again. Round three of kicking ass! Okay, oh, snake person is there too. It, 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 it's okay! This is gonna be painful. Did he just heal himself? Nice and large. What do you do? The power of me- oh wow, you do much- you do too much damage. Why, well, it could be one. My turn. Oh no! Um... Stay right there while I give you a present! Oh no, she attacks us from singing. Commencing research. Uh oh. Here we go! Wake up! Oh. I hope for an end just- That didn't do anything. That didn't do anything. That didn't yeah. do anything but freeze them. So what happened? You were asleep. This about to play? Uh oh. Uh. Okay, this juju. Okay. <sighs> it heals itself. Oh my god! You see that? Excuse me. Coming through. May song 
bring us back, please. Quiet down. Have his peace. Oh no. But here we go. You awake from getting a hut? Time for a detailed overhaul. We're getting healed too at the same time. Hmm, what's going on? By sleeping? Target specimen. Do you have that much HP? Not to see herself. And you may hear go to sleep. That's just great. You're getting a little bit, but it won't do much. You have the worst luck running into me. Alright, child. Get the shield done. Okay, your shield is up, but I'm gonna break it down. Just watch. You just push me again? Oh, I hit you. Coming through. Still asleep. Try that again. May song bring us victory. Okay. Quiet down. My turn. Okay, how about this? I'll break you down. You won't get away. Hmm. Ooh, you know what? Let's do this. Come one. I'll oh, break you. You can't sing anymore. You won't get away. Hey, it's done. It's out of his body. <laughs> that is right. The power of singing, the power of quit damage, quit weight, and then I'm gonna destroy you. Like, my song is better! Like, my song is 100% better than your ass! Burn you away! And then pickaxe, freeze, and melt. Hey, Fozzy. Still don't understand. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Yeah, it took all. Ooh. And you can't run. We got this. We got this. Ah, you can't. So you were trying to freeze me. You can't do that. So fuck you. My scene's too powerful, and you are not a bitch. Now attack. Attack. Now have HP. Nice. Turn. Are we missing again? Oh hell right no. there while I give you a present. Here we go. Bund. Someone come on. The power bud. Coming through. And power up attacking. Quiet down. We should cover our eels. We only those two got it. But they got shield. You can't run! Can't do shit. Attack, but that's okay. Burn. Wake up! I'm sleeping. Ah! Who, who pushed my tits? That thing did. That motherfucker did what to me? And now March is being asleep. Target specimen sighted. March. Oh my god, my girl. Someone, come on. Almost breaking down. Oh wait! Okay, break you down. You won't get away. Nice. You have the worst. Oh, let's shoot myself. The button up. The power of singing. Let's push two right away. Yes, let's do this. Now, three and one. 
saying I'm gonna burn you. I'm gonna burn the fuck out of you. Burn to hell. Attack! Give the sack of the way. Almost dead. Here we go. Swing! And burn! I'm gonna go bye bye! Aha! One as long as the last one, actually. This is the final scene. It's much more straightforward. He wants to expel the harmony and establish an empire based on the order. Let's go. Once this stage play concludes, it'll be time for the main event. The Charmony Festival. Yeah. Now at least I'm glad that was as long as the last like the last two. Oh, I could be mistaken. Like, oh boy, we did all that. So is this the main event? What's going on? That looks like the main event right there. One system out of the China Festival. They the world with meaning, perfecting all things in the heavens and on earth. Then, they rested from the labors of creation. Yet, okay. all beings cried out to Enna. Under the banner of the Order, you have defined all things in the cosmos. But this made us realize that we are but puppets in your hands. Thus, on that day, all beings united and cast the Eon into the abyss of oblivion. This grand theater looks totally different. Is this the power of the Order? Everyone, get ready. This could be a tough battle. Tough battle, huh? Oh, well, I'm gonna bail. Like, subscribe, I'll see you this side.